What is up everyone, this is MoGaming here and today I'm going to show you how to send in your PlayStation 4 controller, your DualSense 4 controller, into Sony for repair. So let's get right into this. So this website, which I will leave in the description and comments below for you guys to check out to be able to do this, is you're able to actually select a variety of products, but today we'll talk about the DualShock 4, DualSense 4, PlayStation 4, whatever you want to call these controllers, uh, and basically uh, put it in to get your, uh, I should say, the repair request started. So I'm going to try, uh, damn it, I don't have the, <laughs> I have a controller in my hand, but it doesn't have a barcode on the back, so I can't do it. Ah, uh, that sucks. I only have one controller, and it's, there's nothing in the back. I'm so sorry. Uh, I won't be able to actually show you for a PlayStation 4 controller, sadly, but essentially what ends up happening is once you put in the barcode here, I had it for PlayStation, oh, that's not it. Uh, I had it for PlayStation 5. Uh, and what essentially ends up happening is once you put it, it's going to ask you when you purchase that controller and again you're probably like hey this is so old why would anyone do this well if you bought the controller recently and even if you bought it a while ago sony will take the repair because it is they have been known to have faulty controllers with the stick drift and other issues that have been happening so once you put in the barcode here they will tell you like when did you purchase it you can kind of give a rough estimate hopefully a accurate estimate but a rough estimate and then it'll ask you certain information and ask you to put in your address you confirm it'll tell you to essentially ship them the product and then they'll fix it or send you a new one so you can essentially like any issue, maybe an analog issue, the stick drift, like I said, the uh, the 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 pad, D pad, or whatever the touchpad you want to call it, uh, all those different issues will get fixed, or they will try to resolve it, I should say, uh, from the best of their abilities, I guess, from their tax perspective. Uh, but yeah, you can essentially get it submitted and put in directly to repair. You don't have to call anyone. You can do it directly from here. And so yeah, that's basically it. Uh, if you guys still have any comments, questions, just let me know in the comment section below. I'm more than happy to you guys out. If you guys overall like this video, please smash that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and click that notification bell. And that, we're going out. Peace.